So what I was saying earlier in the last video is uh, I kind of didn't like this pointy thing here just because when you walked in you just kind of, I don't know, for me anyways, it was, you kind of hit this here. Or if you hit, if maybe you put your head down, you might hit yourself right there. So it wasn't a cut from right here, kind of over here, but I don't think I'm going to do that. Or maybe I will actually. Uh, maybe I won't. Maybe I'll just cut the little piece off right here. So I'm just going to measure it. I think it should just go straight to the edge of the door. This? this yeah. is, or like line up with the door. This? Mm -hmm. If, I mean, if the point is to get rid of like that thing. I guess I could cut it out of the way actually. We could always just cut last two first, see what it looks like, and then, and then go back. So I made two lines. I don't know if you can see that. So I think when I'm about to cut, I'll decide which one I want to cut. But most likely, I think I'm going to do this one. Alright, so I'm about, to take, I'm about to take the side piece off. As I mentioned earlier, there's, there's, like, there's two bolts holding this. Or oh, there's two parts of this. So this is the little part here. Was a side piece, so I'm gonna show you guys how I take that off and how easy it is to take the whole piece off once that's done. It's all pretty much what it is. I just lost the washer, which kind of happens. Which uh, one reason I kind of don't like the setup. But that's about it. As you see, so this bullet is off. See at the bottom, it's off. So from here, it's it's pretty easy to slide this out. So I'll show you guys from the other side. All right, so that's first piece out. So it'll hold it in place and this side's out. Hit that. Okay. And then that. And then that falls on my right toe. Like that. That's cool. Okay. Huh? Right. I'm fine. And as you can see, that was pretty easy, right? That was that's the only bullet I hold on. This is just just side out, just like that. I forget this piece. These, I remember, these pieces were already, we didn't even cut these, right? We didn't cut these, right? I think there was, these were already uh, cut for us. We chose the bottom. I think we bought them of those and they were, they were literally pre-cut, right? This was pre-cut, right? I don't remember. Yeah, this was pre-cut, this was pre-cut. Obviously, this is the center size. And it actually went well together, like, pretty easily, so. Actually, this is a pretty cool little piece, so. All right. So this is a side piece here. And I'm thinking about taking this off to adjust it here at the side, just because it's at a, a small angle here, at a little slant. Or I might just take it off um, all together and figure out a nicer way to do it or easier way to do it. Alright, there's a closer look at that piece I have on the side, so I forget what size bolt this is, but there's actually two bolts. So there's actually two bolts that I have here for some reason. And these go all the way up, and this goes through here. And then it attaches here. And I have a washer that goes here. And that goes right there, and that's what attaches it. Not the greatest 
My upgrade is a cut to you. As you can tell. It's a pretty sloppy job, but but it works. So maybe I'll just spray paint this to make it look cool. So closer look at that. Yeah, that's the same thing for the other side. And like I said, I'm actually just changing. I might just change this up a little bit and get a longer bolt and just go directly from the top piece all the way down. Uh, so I just got the sides here. I don't know if you can tell. This one here is just the driver's side. So I see as I cut this at an angle, and I should pop this little piece off here. And the side angle that I wanted to cut off so it didn't send all the way. So now it's here with the pieces right here. So, same thing on the other side. And I'll show you guys how that looks inside. Here to show you guys how it looks now. So this is cut at an angle. That way when I walk in, you saw in the last video, I don't I don't hit my hand or put my head down. I don't hit my head. This corner is fine because once we put the top on here, uh, that should be flush with that. Uh, that shouldn't be too much of a problem. All right, so looking good. Looking good so far. I'm still working on this idea here. Uh, I believe what I'm going to do is I'm going to just get a bowl that goes all the way up here. Probably get probably get an uh, oversized washer. And I can just tie it out with a ring nut or something. And I should keep that in place. It's a lot easier, but we'll see. Yep, that's how it looks. And the other side doesn't look exactly the same. Uh, as you can see here, I also cut this piece off here. That way it's not sticking out. All right, another thing I want to work on is, as you guys can see here, the back here is not level. Uh, I don't remember who mentioned, but the element is naturally higher on one side and lower on one side. I'm not sure which which side is which, but I also do know that we got a, a three inch lift on the back compared to the two and a half in the front. So it is off, I'm assuming at least by an inch. So as you can see here, off so if I do raise this you can see there so I'm off a little bit so before we actually finish this uh, platform in the back I'm actually gonna have to raise I'm have to raise this whole platform here at least put some uh, put some type of spacer at the bottom so you can see right now, I put a features piece of a uh, 2 by 4 at the bottom here. And that gives it a little bit of space. You can see it's still not level. Just I'm up uh, by a little bit. I mean, it looks... It looks like I'm just going to end up using a 2x4 just like that. Not all the way through. Maybe I'm going to move this or get a longer piece and go all the way to the end. Or maybe just put it in the middle. Just center it. Uh, and I think the sides would be fine. Then what I would leave it is with a gap. Which is fine because when I was thinking about this, actually this bottom here could become also storage. So for example... You know, we, we've kept this map here of the United States. Um, it's from 2018, so maybe I have to update on that. But as you can see here, I can uh, we can place pieces of paper that are important, uh, small things, items like that, and get them out of the way. And that clears up space over here for a little, something a little bit more useful. Right? So that's kind of what I'm thinking right now. I'm going to see what my wife says and what she thinks. But that's kind of what I'm thinking right now. You know, it's an easy fix. So we'll see how that goes.
Another thing that I'm going to work on is since we don't have the spare tire at the bottom, I'm, I think I'm, I'm about to start working on this part here. Um, we don't really need it. Like I said, there's nothing down there right now, so I might end up taking this off already and start working on covering the bottom somehow and eventually start deciding what to store down there. I'm not too sure if it's going to be the external battery that we're going to get uh, just because it'll be really hard to get to once the fridge is in here. Uh, so we'll see how that goes. And this is, uh, in case you guys couldn't see it in the other video, this is the other piece that we're probably going to get rid of. Even though it's cool. Uh, I know it has a little bit of storage here on the side. Uh, but I think if we got rid of it, I think it's kind of loose already, but um, I believe if we got rid of it, you probably end up having a lot more space on the side there. So instead of being rounded off, it'll be a perfect rectangle and we can slot things in there. So another spot, another spot I think would be very useful to put the electrical uh, system. Um, would it be right here in the side panel? Since there is pretty good space here, uh, we'll put a panel there and set everything up there. Uh, maybe put the battery, put the battery down here. You know, connect all here on the side. That way, only have to. If there's a problem, if we need to get connecting in new lights, etc., uh, it's easy to get to. You know, and am I using? Just end up using the bottom here as just storage for things that. You may occasionally need, but we don't need right away.